like a hematoma right there. <laughs> hey, so what, what, what's this about? You were, you were sparring? Yes, with Eli. And then what happened? I, I checked his kick. <laughs> you checked his kick? Yes, you want to see it? Yeah, let, let, let's see it. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> this is what happens when you spar with a freaking gorilla. Oh, look, at, look at how big that is. That's gonna hurt. It hurts. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Oh yeah. Damn. All right. Teach me grappling. What's up guys? Maria, come out here, I need you. We're just gonna we're gonna hit a video real quick. Let's do it. Um so those shins, you sure you're okay? I'm good. I'm All a right. fucking beast. <laughs> sorry. I'm sorry just about the language. We just got demonetized. Listen. I'm sorry. She's a, a nice young lady normally, but I'll work on the language later. Alright? Let's go. Alright. On your back. Okay. Um today we were again going over the double underpass this week in class. And we, we did a drill, are you ready? Mm -hmm. So when, when first for you, when I start to stack you, you're gonna resist at first, and then when I push hard, you're gonna backward roll, and then lift your head, and then double leg. See that? And then now she's gonna, I'm gonna replace guard, she's gonna go double unders. She's trying to put pressure against me. You see that? I'm gonna backward roll, Lift my head up, oh, look at her weight end up here. This could be a kind of a crazy scramble. I put my arm between the legs. I, I don't want to get caught in the crucifix. I'm a big crucifix guy, so yeah, try. I cut the arm between the body. Trip, take you down, you ready? Now, notice, you, I'm gonna do what, what you just did, okay? okay? I'm gonna put myself way over you so you can do what I did, okay? okay? So when I go here, if I make a mistake, you see that? No, 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 no. Just pulse your hair uh, under your face. <laughs> a little bit to the right, a little bit. Now push your head up and lift. Oh, look at that. Now take a leg, yeah, and lift and put me down. I'm not gonna get you at a Christmas. Yeah, good, but like you gotta route yourself back on top. Good job. I recover, go double under. Okay, so watch again. When you push yourself, if, if they end up like too much right here, if I catch this leg, I'm free of that crucifix. If I catch this leg, I could take this leg and then limp on. There's different ways I can kind of like recover the position. Go ahead, try, here's your turn again. Okay, boom. See, I'm not, I'm not way over you, so just double leg me. Good. Let's do it one more time for you, so you can lift me. Let's say I get too much. I push myself a little too much. Boom, oh no, lift, lift. Yes. Now, how do you want to finish? Let's try uh, the champion kind of finish. You're gonna raise the arm up, like, yeah, like lift, and then, and then step your left leg up, and then tr basically kind of like come out the back door. Throw the leg to the this direction and pivot. Yeah, you see that? Nice. That's a good one. Okay. Very good. Here, I'll, I'll do that one for you. Put, get this double under. I'm like fighting. Oh no! I get here and I lift. Now look, guys. As as, as I lift up here, I try to capture. Put my leg up and I relax. And, and then I didn't pop out between your legs because you you fell that way. If you were to stay like this, I would have popped out the back like this. Okay, that's kind of how you did. Mm -hmm. So, we, we, we did this to teach people when they are getting stacked a lot, there is an attempt at a backward roll. Sometimes, depending on your flexibility level, you might feel like you have to because you, you're gonna break your neck. You know, you were talking about that, right? Yes. Like you had some big guys like smashing you. Yes. Sometimes, She's smashing, and I'm like in the middle. Okay, easy, easy, slow, so I can talk. Okay, now you, you know me, right? Like I, no, no, no. Just chill, chill for a second. Come on back. Just lock your hands. All right, all right. 
Thank you, Maria. Okay, so the point is, she, it will get real. And when it gets real, you, if it's in the center, if you're not real flexible, like myself, guys, I, I, I'll show you when I'm done right now. Uh, uh, 27 years of grappling, my chin won't go to my chest anymore. So my head doesn't go down like that and it doesn't touch my chest. So when, when you start to do it, it really does bother me. So what I have to do, I have to resist. And then if she forces the issue, I have to allow myself to back and roll. So look at how I put my hand on the mat so that I can come out to my right shoulder. And then as I come out, now I'm here on a single leg, double leg, and I'm taking her down. Okay, see that? So if I end up here and you get that big strong person, who, yeah, see how you're already trying to escape? Yeah. Um, don't, don't escape, wait for the right moment. Resist me, like you wanna fight me. If like you're grabbing my hands, let's say. Okay. And I'm like, yeah, you see? Now, all in one, go. And you can, yeah, go. Now, that's it, take me down. Obviously, you can't sit there forever because you will get your back taken uh, at some point. So now we're gonna show you guys the back take. So there's always two sides to the coin. We don't wanna let people do that to us. When, when I'm here and I get the double under and I position myself personally, I like to grip and grip here and then I'm shelving here. I'm shelving her butt on my knee and then when she tries to roll, I kind of slow her process. So one version is to let make force her to roll, but slow her down. See my elbow right here? I'm slowing you down. I'm position. I'm driving your hips so you can't like try to come back. No, try to roll back. Yeah, you see, you ran into my body, and my knee is still here. So my knee, I don't let her hip fall like that. So I'm keeping her hip elevated so that if she tried to fall, she can't fall. And I'm forcing her into the turtle, but when I do, I'm already inserting this hand here, sorry about that. And now I've got my seatbelt. It's up to you how you wanna do the next move. I can drive my knee inside, step on the ankle. So go to the backside and see. So I drove my knee inside, I step on the ankle. Before her butt can sit down, like sit the butt down. Just, no, 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 just sit down on your ankle. Now I have no room. So when I sit, come back forward now, if I keep the pressure here and you're trying to sit back, I put my foot. Now I can pull you and then come to the other side. All the way around. Now look at my foot. This foot, it was, can you lift your leg a little? Okay, my foot was like this, my knee was inside. Now I straighten my leg and I can get my hook in. Hip escape a little and then get my second hook. And then we're always looking for the attack. So that's one version, okay? Show you one more time a little bit quicker. So I get this position. She's about to go, I slow her process. Keep going. My elbow's here, keep going. And then I lock the seatbelt. I jam my knee inside, see? And I step right there. Try to sit back. See how I'm stepping? And now I'm falling. Straightening, putting my hook in. If you guys really like the truck position, you can lock that leg down and come up into these kind of attacks. Uh, the twister, the banana split. She grabs my hands or tries to defend. Boom, you guys can go into the twister, which Maria's a big fan, aren't you? Yeah. Good, good, good. <laughs> All right. So, and then the last one is this version. So, we get the double under, we're driving them up. I know she wants to go. I'm gonna drop from my toes to my knees. And now I have a body lock around her hips. I'm gonna force you without breaking your neck to touch your toes to the mat. Slow, yeah, like this. Now, I don't want her to be comfortable. And Maria, I know you're kind of like a little nervous. Maybe you hurt your neck today. I do wanna manhandle her a little bit and force her like this. Just go ahead, I'm gonna, don't wanna hurt you, just touch your toes so I can teach. Good. So see how her legs are dangling? 
Next, I'm gonna position my knee over here, step on the ankle with a body. It's the same thing basically with this reverse cut wrench or body lock. And then now I pull, sit back, feed the leg into the triangle. There's the truck position, control the toes, look for the calf lock right there. Okay, or if you guys wanna come back to twister or just go ahead and come back to the neck. You can come back to the neck. So Maria, which one did you like when you practiced? The, the, the reverse body lock, like that, that lock around the waist, or did you like more to just go to the seat belt? I like the seat belt. You like the seat belt. Okay, so then I'm gonna force you to do the other one. Okay? okay. So, so when she's here, go ahead, just lock, lock. Now, start to stack me. Keep going, good. Now, once I'm here, I want you to drop to your knees and get your body to slide Basically, to connect your stomach and your chest to my lower back. Yes, relax, relax. Okay. Drop your chest down. Yes. Do you see the angle now? So she's basically positioned herself here. Now, as I'm trying to back a roll, don't allow me. And then now, you see, like push me a little bit until my feet hit their back and I can't get at it. Now, I would choose this one. Mm -hmm. With your right foot, you're gonna step, your left knee will slide in. Left knee slide in the hole. And step, there you go. Now thread it in, bring it in, nice. And now next, it's your choice. I could try to, if I grab your hands, and I'm trying to fight here, you catch the twister. This hand, there's your trap. You grab the wrist. This is your first time ever doing twister? Yeah. Awesome. Yeah. We love first times here. Drop, drop this nice and tight in a triangle. Okay. Remember guys, every single twister, never do a lockdown. Do a lockdown, you know what lockdown is? Yeah. yeah. Don't do that because then the foot will go inside. See the foot, it pries it loose. Always triangle. Okay. Triangle tight on twisters, okay? You can do it on a banana split, but not on a twister. So they can't get their foot inside. Now you're gonna pull this back, two hands, pull it back, and then pull it all over your, over your head. Nice, now shoot the left hand all the way through. And go get the neck. And now once you get the neck, you gotta let go of that one. And you gotta look for that S grip. Yeah. And now if they won't tap, good. If they won't tap because they're tough, it's usually because you're on the neck. You always wanna go upper head. Oh my gosh, that's it. What, is your last name Pajaras? Man, she don't let go. How many times I gotta tap, bro? Go, go, do it again. Yeah, okay. All right. Oh my gosh. Oh, God. <laughs> oh. Free adjustment. Why, why do they call that the twister? That's a wrestler guillotine or guillotine. Anyway, it's also the twister. That was, that was your first legit twister. Yeah. We swear. Yeah, we never did swear. this first time. Thank All you. legit. Reality TV right here. Thank you, Maria. So what are you going to do about your shin? Are you going to go home and like ice it? Like, what are you going to do? Nah. You're, aren't you on nerves? Yes, I am. <laughs> so you got You need some like care or something. I don't know. Yeah, it'll be fine. Maybe a little ibuprofen or what? Take it like a champ. She's just gonna. <laughs> That's it. All right, guys. Hope you enjoyed. Uh, teach me grappling. Click that like down below. Click that share. Share it with your friends. And uh, the Patreon links down there. PayPal if you guys want to uh, contribute to this channel. It would be much appreciated. Last thing I gotta say, guys, this Saturday, I'm doing a seminar clinic. I'm gonna flash the flyer up on the screen. Check this out. It's gonna be in Pinon Hills, and I believe it's from one o'clock to four o'clock. Uh, it's gonna be awesome, and they're gonna have a barbecue too. So I hope you guys enjoy uh, that, if you can make it. If you're in Southern California, yeah, it's out in the desert, but it's gonna be a lot of fun. We're gonna be working on some takedowns, some other grappling techniques. So if you guys can make it this Saturday, Pinon Hills, please do. All right. Thank you guys so much. We'll see you guys next time with more great stuff.